five things narcissists do to trap you. The narcissist knows that they are not deserving of you. They know that you would not want to be around them. If you knew what they really are. So they have to trap you in their web. They have to catch you in their complex system of interconnected elements to prevent you from escaping. Because they know that anyone in your position would want to leave. They understand that they're not something you would choose to be around. Which is why they have to trap you. They have to find ways to keep you locked in. So here are five things that they will do to do that. One, love bombing. Narcissists have had years of practice. They're good at reading people. They know how to manipulate you. They know what they have to say or do to lure you in. They know how to get you where they need you. So that they can get what they want from you. They will tell you whatever they think you want to hear. To make you trust them. To make you give them a chance. That is how they manipulate you. That is how they pull you into their realm. Two, future faking. Once the narcissist has given you this false impression, you may want to see it materialize. You may want to see the product that they have just sold to you. And this is when the narcissist will use future faking. They will promise you something in the future. They will keep you waiting. They will keep you thinking that one day you will get what you want. And things are going to change. They will sell you a dream. But it's all fake. You will never receive anything from them. The situation will not benefit you in any way. Because they're just using the future faking to keep you around so that they can continue getting what they want from you. Three, devaluation. When the narcissist sees that you're getting fed up of waiting for things to change, it will offend them. They will see it as an insult. Because they expect you to see it as a privilege just to be around them. So rather than letting you have the opportunity to criticize their lack of investment in the relationship, they will devalue you. Despite everything that you have done for them and everything that you may continue to do for them, they will minimize it or they will just avoid discussing it.
But if you were to stop doing those things for them, they would get very angry. It makes you feel like you can't leave. As though your only option is to stay with them and do everything they want you to do. While they continue to devalue you. Because they want you to stay where you are. They want you to feel like you wouldn't be any good for anyone or anything. As though they're the only ones who can help you. When they're actually the one thing that is holding you back. Four, isolation. The narcissist will isolate you. They will make you dependent on them. And they will turn you against your family or friends or turn your family and friends against you so that you have no one but them. They become your only source of influence. Which means that they can tell you whatever they want. And you're not going to know what's right or what's wrong. They want you to feel like they're the only person that you can depend on. They abuse you. But then they also want to be the ones who make you feel better. They want to be the ones that you confide in. So that they can have control over you. It maintains a code of silence. when no one outside of you and the narcissist knows what's really going on. Five, smear campaign. Even if you do manage to figure out what they're doing to you and you find it enough strength to leave, the narcissist isn't going to let you go so easily. They fear that you might reveal who they really are to other people. Which is why they were already saying horrible things about you to people while they were isolating you. So even if you leave the narcissist it just confirms a twisted narrative to other people. The narcissist has manipulated. About how you don't support them. About how you're abandoning them. It just makes you look bad. Because they don't know about everything you've been through. They don't know about the suffering and the misfortune that you have endured. It just looks like you're running away from someone who has done everything for you. Because that's the narrative that narcissists feed to people. Even if they have only made your life difficult and inconvenient. The game is rigged. It's a setup from the start. And it is all designed to trap you. It's designed to keep you under their control. Just so they can use and abuse you.
and get away with it without facing the consequences for their actions. Because that's really what they were looking for when they targeted you. They were looking for someone who they could do all of these horrible things to. Someone who didn't have a voice. Someone who didn't have any support. So that they could do whatever they want with you. And not have to answer to anyone. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at coaching at narcsurvivor.co.uk. Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.